Well, Jen and Tom, police here in Manchester are looking into a pair of incidents. This cross box belonging to Fairpoint here at the corner of Lake and Hanover Streets was left wide open, but otherwise apparently untouched. But another cross box over at the corner of Webster and River Road was thoroughly damaged. You can take a look at some video right now of that damage. Wires that appear to be cut, torn, and pulled out. Fairpoint officials on scene said it would take a couple hours to repair, but in the meantime, an unspecified number of customers in that area are without phone service. The telecom says it is very unlikely that any member of the public would have known how to access these boxes. There is, of course, a strike right now at Fairpoint, and the company believes these incidents are connected. Manchester Mayor Ted Gatzis says, independent of any labor issues, this is a concern for public safety. Certainly, that that gives me great concern for the safety of the citizens of Manchester in regards to 911 and uh, fire alarms and police alarms. In a statement released within the last hour or so, Fairpoint said, "Quote: They appear to be acts of sabotage and are threatening the public safety that could endanger the lives of our customers. They are more than bullying and intimidation. They have the potential for putting lives at risk. We call on the union to ensure its members and sympathizers cease all such activities." Strong words there, but the union rep we spoke to called these accusations baseless and said its workers protest peacefully and they do not condone any kind of vandalism. Reporting live in Manchester, Adam. Sexton, WMUR News 9.